So my professional journey is quite interesting. It is quite interesting. Um, I started out as a user experience, user research consultant in 2005. I worked with some of the big folks like eBay um, early on. I led the redesign of the train line, which is the UK train ticketing website in 2010. And then my biggest um, project I probably ever worked on was the redesign of Marriott.com in 2014. Across a huge host of countries and languages, um, huge billions of dollars go through that site every year. And that was full research from researching across, I think we were researching about 20 countries, um, to a full redesign and relaunch of the whole online booking platform, which was very exciting and a lot of fun. I then worked with startups for a little while, um, involved in product and product strategy, ultimately. Then I moved from there into working with CEOs. The reason I did that is my background and what was dispersed amongst that background was I studied neuroscience at university, so psychology and cognitive psychology. And I've also got a master's in human computer interaction or communication theory, really. So it's how computers communicate with each other and how humans communicate with each other. And both of those things have really given me a fascination as well as my background in user experience into, into humans and how humans make decisions and choices. And one of the things I was always fascinated about and wanted to learn more about and where I followed my curiosity to was working with CEOs. Why do they make the decisions and choices that they do? Are they operating from the best places? If not, can I help them operate from the best places? And that's really what I do now. So I work with CEOs from early stage startup, uh, typically venture backed, through to scale up, through to exit. So I also run a mastermind group for exiting founders who are about to exit their business. I also work with founders post exit to help understand what, what's next for them, as well as working with CEOs of larger enterprises too. So I kind of work across the world of CEOs, both in tech and non-tech. And really my drive behind that is an innate curiosity for how humans work and how decisions and choices are made. And my support and my skills are brought to bear on that to really help CEOs make better choices and decisions.